Hello guys and welcome back by another first look. This time I'm looking at a Stranded Deep. This is not really a first look because I tried some things out already to see how it works because it is a, a survival game. Uh, it is in the middle of the week so it is kind of a special first look and that's all because uh, we won it on Geek Domo's Twitch channel. My hosting lines won it and he gave it to me so that I could do a first look about it. And I utterly love the game. So. So, and just because uh, we want it, I wanted to do it like that. Just in the middle of the week. Have a martini, please. And still, I don't really know uh, how it works. All of it. Even though I've been playing it for a little while now. Oh, a little while. About three hours, maybe. It's a trolley. Oh, you can open and close the door. Is there anything special in there? No. So, let's go and take a seat. So I really really also want to thank Geek Domo and the guy who made it possible for the giveaway. claims another victim. Oh, that's it. So the thing you need to do is go to your life raft. And that's the intro of the game. So there we are. This is Stranded Deep. You can see all different kind of... Oh, shite. Do you see that? That's not good. So we need to hurry. Before he kicks off out of... Oh, he's following. Shite. So that's the start of Stranded Deep. We need to... Get on that island. Before the show found us out of the life raft. Where's the shark, you worky? Okay, he's gone. I normally put this back in my live raft because you don't need it for anything else except for your live raft. With the right mouse button, you can pull it ashore. With Q, you can put the pedal in there. So, this is our island. It's freaking small, it's how it seems. We have a. Oh, it's not freaking small. Oh, this is perfect. The island that I have on my single player. Six. So the thing that you need to do is survive. You need to find uh, rocks. The thing that I hold in my hand now is one of the important things that you need to find and these sticks. Um, with the rocks and the sticks you can make various things you really need. The thing you start with is a lighter which you really need. It will probably last forever. Kind of true and your pocket knife you need to find food, you need to find water while well, you have a bottle bottle it's not infinite from a bucket to so fresh water so it's definitely not infinite and you need to harvest crabs 
you just one thing you need to cook the crab before you can eat it crabs are lethal well not lethal they will make you sick just grab some stuff I need a yucca plant oh there oh no don't go in there with shift you can run yucca thank you so there you get lashings and lashings you need to build things together there we go um, potato plant over there so that we can eat potatoes are something you can just eat um, but it doesn't really give a lot you get three out of a plant there is a little it's right in there so every time uh, you can get potatoes over there sticks come here stick you need a lot of sticks so just let's see what we have rocks can respawn i haven't seen that myself but i saw it on Angitomo's channel that it respawned what well, it was a stick um something respawned the yucca plants and the potato plants respawn the pl potato plant takes about two game days and the yucca plant like an hour then you can get your lessons. There was a toolbox in here. A hard case. Open it, please. A flare. Alright, I hope there was something in there that I could use. Okay, so let's make an X and stuff like that. You with tab you go to your inventory. You can click it with Q, you just pile it up. Like that. You put the rocks close by not close enough now it's close enough so that everything links together you put the lash links or whatever they call in there too and then you see that you get normally when you add something they will grow glow and now you get some kind of thing so we make an crude eggs and we make a crude hammer those you really need um, with the hammer, as you can see, when you hold the hammer, it's getting blue. Uh, we cannot do anything at this moment because we need those to make a bed or to make basically most of the things a foundation for a hut, a raft, a spear. I will try to make a spear to show you guys what you can do with that. Do I still have a rock? No. Or oh, that sucks. Let's find a rock or stone however you want to call it so I basically just wanted to try a little bit out because it is it is an early access it is on steam for 15 15 bucks they said so probably it should be 15 euros also um, I have no clue because I I got it so I didn't really look at what the price was or anything it is at this moment a single player they are going to make they are going to make it yes oh your base all belong to us hey. they are going to make it um multiplayer that sound that you hear now should we try to kill it should we try to kill it come here little shocky come here little shocky walkie shocky come here i want to kill you shock I cannot kill the shark. The shark is going away. Oh well. Normally with a knife you will be able to kill a shark if you do it the right way, not what I just did. Oh balls, there were two! Holy dick. That's also a bug in the game at this moment. I don't know where he is now, but that's a um strand shark. <laughs> when you hear that sound. You know that's a shark nearby. I don't know where he is, but he is close. He is going there. See that? If you find a rock, you can split it in half. I don't have any rocks left, do I? No. You can split the rock in half. And when you split it in half, you can make a spear or a knife. And with a spear, you can spare, um, what do you call those, crabs and fish. 
Sardines you can eat right away, they will not make a problem. And uh, crabs, don't do it. They will make you sick. And I've lost a problem with sand sharks, obviously. So that sucks. Um, let's see. We made a... I don't need a hammer. We made a... Opa. A thing. So this one is pretty big. Oh, you can just climb on top of it to get the coconuts. But... Oh, uh, that was not really smart what I just did. I think I broke something. See those coconuts? You can just hit them. So you can get the green stuff out of it. Oh, and then you can hit them to make a drinkable coconut. And then you obviously cannot open it because your inventory is full. Oh, I need that one. I don't need that one at the moment. So we take it. Redrink it. Can I drink it another time? No. Sometimes when you drop it down and you pick it up again. You can drink it. Nope. So, you take another time your eggs and you hit it a few times. It doesn't seem like you're doing anything. But you are. And this is what you can eat. And it gives you like... I'm not even hurt. Alright, so I don't even need it. But if you eat it, it gives you like a whole bar. Most of the times. See, now I'm full. Here you can see that it's sunny. I have no idea what the Fahrenheit is, so I don't know how much the that is in, in, in Celsius. It is almost 3 o'clock. When it is 18 o'clock, then uh, the problem is... That is getting dark. When it's getting dark, you cannot really do anything. But you push this one, and then what you can do for that is. Oh, close. Come on, hit it. If you hit it 10 times, it will break down. There is still a shark underneath me. I can hear him and I can hear this music. So, when you take off all the trunks, then you can have this part. And that will. Oh, there it is. It is it's a great white, is it? Don't match with the great white sharks. They are too powerful. Now we have palm fans. But we need them for sticks. The thing that I would recommend is you can go to every other island that you can see even if you cannot see them holy shit just go and look where they are um if you go with your raft there is a buck in there at this moment uh, that your raft can just despawn why i have no idea so most of the time i just uh swim with a spear in my hand because you really really need a spear if you have a spear the sharks won't bite as as much or as fast I found out when you got bitten by a shark you're doomed you can make a basic a uh, big campfire if you would want to you can also make this one just put it down take your lighter fire it up get your crabs put them on the ground and balance them on your fire if you balance balance them right they will stay on there and you don't have to stand there holding them. See? If you hear something like a microwave ding, then you know your crab is good. And it is still half an hour to go until it's really getting dark. And when it's really getting dark, you'll not be able to really go on the water or... Well, you could, but I would not recommend this because this is already dark and when the when the lights go when the sun is gone you cannot see any sh anything on the water be really careful with sea urchins they are poisonous they will poison you i found some duct tape okay awesome there's still no clue what we can do with duct tape oh the thing that you can see is you're not really drowning but as you can there, wait, no, not now. 
when you go into the water and your corners are getting darker and your character is trying to reach forward with his hands see that's the sound of a done cook he cooked crap so you take that one off and you put your other crap on there if you cook them you can just perfectly eat them So if you get bitten, you just need to eat, sleep, drink for a long period of time. Because if you're being bitten by a shark, it will take off 0.25 every second. Or every second, I guess. Um, or every whatever. And if you eat and sleep, and if you are over 80%, it will give you... 1% of your health so make sure you're always above 80 and anything if you're bleeding and you're starting to swim you definitely will attract some shocks definitely all right so let's make a foundation whatever just want to show something so we're just going to make a foundation good and then we're going to not pick anything up because I'm full. I'm going to put you guys here. We want to take that one. The support. We want to have support. I'm just showing you guys something. I'm not really. I don't know. This is not something I will progress. Because then I made a really bad start. Some trees are bugged and they will not go as needed and my crap fall off. So push you over there. And that sound of that shark, it, that's also a bug that they go in the sand of your island. They can also bite you in there. Pretty annoying sometimes. Oh, sh shite. Didn't want to do that, but I won't. This is basically the thing that you can do to go through your night when you don't have a bed yet. Which I somehow am not able to make. And I can't really remember what I need for a bed. Crab's done. Good scrap, good scrap. I saw a crab over here. You. It is also a thing that where you be careful where you make your fireplaces because if they burn out you have a patch where you cannot do anything anymore. So that's that's kinda I don't know. You just can't do anything there. Burn out and burn out. And I don't know why he does that, but Okay, come on. And this will probably lift everything up. This is a lot of... Pull it up. I think the shark are angry. Normally you will get four out of the end, uh, four out of everything basically. So four of those, four of anything else. Beep beep.
I'm sorry, little crab, but I really need you for my food. Shove the other one off. Crab doesn't do much, but oh well, you need something to eat, right? So if I take a crab and I would eat it, it didn't even really give me one point. I can make a roof, a foundation, a wall, and support. Well, supports are standing there. A roof is standing there. I have enough of those. You can plant. Come on, pick it up. Oh, I'm pushing wrong buttons again. fire is gone so you have that and that you can do nothing can I now make something that I want to make please no oh well we're going to build a wall so you can just put them in there another wall put it in there a roof I want to have a roof on there can I put a roof on it? no oh shite that was not really what I wanted to do so then everything explodes obviously I need to have another support and then I can put a roof on it yes so that's done so raft come on we, we need to go on a journey Get in there. Good. Thank you. And then, hopefully, my rev will not disappear. We are going to. Oh, well, I guess that one. Probably. Most of the people say when you're in your rev, you need to be at the middle and you need to crouch. If you do that, you have the best chance for it to not despawn. Well, sometimes it helps for me, sometimes it just didn't. You can also swim, but it takes a long time. And I can sucks. That didn't really sound good. There is a compass in the game which you can find in a, in a sunken, sunken boats. I haven't found one yet, but I saw a weasel found one. There is a sunk boat. But there was a shark. I don't know. I can't really tell if that's a boat or a shark. Oh, we tried. That's our island. That's the island that we're going to. So hopefully my raft will stay and it will not disappear underneath me. Otherwise we have to swim the rest. Was that a shark? No, that was a sardine. And there is a boat in front of it sunk. Alright, so just to be able to show you guys this, I will cut out the part where I had that little fight with the shark, put you over there, and I don't hear or see any shark close by, so let us just see this. So, this is a boat. As you guys can see, sometimes this boat doesn't have it, obviously. There is loot. Inside the boat.
Oh, balls, it is raining. Are you kidding me? No, it's not raining. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, guys. I would want to show you guys more of the boat, but it's raining, so we need to get on that island. Because in the rain... Oh, the sound is horrible. In the rain, you cannot see anything anymore. It's dark. Holy shit, the rain. So my live ref didn't go away, so that is good. That one of the first time that I did. And we need to find Rob. So now we're on a different island. The island looks very different. Everything is just generated. And you what you can see. Yeah, it's raining. Obviously, we didn't know that before. A rock, cool, nice. Now we need a yucca so that I can show you guys how it works. Not a rock. Did I get it? No, I don't. Potato plant, I don't need to eat right now. Another potato plant. I saw a yucca. Yeah, the sound of rain is pretty realistic, but it is way too hard. I hope you guys can still understand me either. I need even have to put down the sound of my hands. So we put one of you down, we put one of you down, we put one of you down, with that we're making headaches, and we put you down, and then we take the eggs. And it looks like you're missing it. But, there it is. We found rock shards. If you put that one down, and that one down, with those. You can make a knife! I want to have done something else. I think I need another stick. Come on. Come on. Open my inventory, please. That would be awesome if you would want to do that. That's also sometimes a bug. I'll be able to make a good spear. There it is. That's what I want to show you guys. The way we can try and catch a sardine. Oh wait, where, where did the teddy go? And we have one. So it's perfect for fishing. If you hit them. But it's honestly nothing for a shark fight. That. If you go deeper in the sea, you can find angel fish and anything like that. You need to cook those, otherwise you will get sick. The sardines you can eat just out of the palm of your hand. You need a full to get one up in your house. But I'm not that. But that's what your spear does, and if you use this while you're swimming, it seems that the sharks won't attack you as much. I don't know if that's bullshit, but that's what, what I thought happened. And this is basically an island with not much. The thing that I will be doing here is, if you look at that shipwreck, mine get the trees down. No, oh, don't fall. Be careful when you fall down a tree, you can break your leg. I know only some kind of antibiotics can help you with that. So, yeah, be really careful with that. Be really careful with that. Sometimes it seems like you're doing nothing, but indeed you are. So, done! Well, this is all that I can show for now. I mean, it is just the first look that I'm trying to give you guys. It looks pretty amazing. You saw a shark. Uh, you see the rain. 
a shipwreck, two islands. Uh, you can go to it. You can also just swim to the next island if you would want to. Put your spear out. It seems that if you swim underwater, you swim faster. I don't know if that is bullshit. I saw I thought I saw a shark. So we're basically back here again. Ah, this my spear. <laughs> There's nothing in this ship worthwhile. Maybe there is, but I didn't find it. Can I open anything here? Normally you would find some kind of a chest or anything that you can open where uh, you can find the torch or anything like that. But well, this was uh, Stranded Deep. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys liked it. I hope I will see you guys in the next episode that I make. Bye bye!